Hi guys, Philip here from My Cash. In this video, I'm going to talk to you about 10 different ways you can use to make, to make money online without investment. Uh, so in other words, these are 10 ways you can uh, use uh, um, to make money online without spending any money. You don't need a website, you don't need any hosting of any sort, you don't need any software, you don't need any training, you don't need anything. Okay. Uh, basically, I'll, I'll talk to you. I'll, I'll talk you through some websites and some services where you can go and start making money online today without spending a single penny. But before I start that, I just want to point out I have some free training for you underneath, underneath this video. I don't need your email address. Okay, just click the link below and you get free access to uh, seven videos, which will talk you through uh, some things about making money online. But for now, I'll jump in and show you these ten different websites you can use to start making money online today uh, without spending any money. Okay, let's go. Okay, so the first website is called Easy Shift. Uh, this is essentially a website where you, it's, it's, a, it's a, an app that you download and you are essentially given tasks to do by companies. Uh, and as you can see here by the screen, it usually involves um, checking uh, sort of product displays in shops or you know, maybe a mystery shop or basically doing some very, very, very simple tasks in return for a small fee. And uh, you basically just uh, download the app and uh, check out what tasks are available near you. And you go and check it and you, you prove you've been there by taking, taking a picture and so on and you get paid. Now obviously this will this only works if, if you're in the city, right? <laughs> if, you, if you live in, in the countryside, it's very unlikely to have anything for you. Uh, but obviously uh, if you live in a the city then this will be a very cool way of making a few extra bucks here and there and the cool best thing is you know it's 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 just an app you just download it and start okay now the same goes for the next one here uh, which is uh, called field agent uh, this is very similar uh, you download the app and you basically uh, go and complete uh, tasks uh, that they give you now what tasks you're going to get uh, I have no idea I mean it just totally depends on uh, the, the app and what they're offering but like I said most of them will involve some kind of product placement check or maybe like a mystery shopping or doing some simple tasks of that nature but the thing is if you're getting paid four or five bucks for just walking into a shop and checking a shelf you know it's it's very easy money right and the same goes for the next one which is a uh, gig walkers you simply download the app and or sign up and off you go and you start uh, getting matches on your uh, GPS on your map there and you can take gigs and start uh, working all right now obviously uh, well, as I said before this, this will only work if you're in a city uh, but you know you could potentially download all of these and use all of them at the same time and maybe you will be able to get uh, quite a few gigs per day right and the next one is obviously Fiverr okay Let's face it, everybody knows what Fiverr is by now. Uh, they, they are huge. Uh, for this, you obviously need some kind of skill, right? You need to, you need to be able to do something. Um, so my suggestion is that you simply pop onto Fiverr, Fiverr.com, have a look around, and find something that you can do, right? It doesn't need to be amazing. It doesn't need to be the, 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 the best thing in the world. Just do find something simple, straightforward, that you can do for 5, 10, 15 bucks, okay? Uh, and I think you'd be surprised that you know once you've got three or four gigs up there, and you maybe you get one or two gigs per day, it does build. And as your uh, rating increases, and as your uh, basically your your awareness increases, and your skill level increases, uh, things will start to change. Uh, so I would I would just suggest you come in here, have a look through all these categories here, because there are so many weird and wonderful people on um, Fiverr doing all kinds of weird, wonderful, and crazy things. So it's definitely worth looking at. Um, and the next one is Upwork. Now, once again, this requires you to have some kind of uh, predefined skill set. Either you're a writer, or maybe you're a marketer, or maybe you're a designer, or maybe you're a developer of some sort, or you have some kind of technical skill which you can rent out. Um, once again, I would suggest you come in here and just uh, create an account and have a look at the different categories, look at the other gigs that are being put up here, and see if you can do the same. See if you can compete, okay? Now this is a bit more sort of up market kind of thing, uh, but it's a very viable option and it doesn't cost anything, right? It's free. Uh, you, you only uh, sort of the, the Upwork will take a cut out of any payments you get on some some way or another, but it doesn't cost you anything. 
the next one is uh, Kindle. Uh, you can publish your own Kindle ebook, uh, which you can sell on Amazon. Uh, again, this is totally free. Uh, the only sort of thing you have to do is obviously write write an ebook, right? Uh, but uh, once again, if you are a writer or if you have certain skills in the writing niche, then you are able to do this um, because ultimately, you don't to to write an, a Kindle ebook. You don't have to be a full time professional writer, right? Uh, obviously, you do need to be a skilled. Uh, you, you need to have some skill for, with writing, but you don't need to be professional, right? Uh, people often misunderstand and think that you have to be, uh, you know, uh, you have to be some kind of uh, qualified author to be able to do this, but you don't, okay? As long as you write coherently and you write good content, then that's enough. Um, because there are services out there which will proofread your content for you uh, for a small fee. Uh, so this is an option uh, for you because it's a very, 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 very a cost-effective way of making money online. Uh, the next one here is a very, again uh, Skillshare. This is a website where you can create courses for people um, out there because they're think of think of all the things you can do in the world, whether it's uh, baking or web development or um, photography or exercise or you know any kind of business ventures, but anything you can think of online. There are people who want to learn. There are people who want to have a course, a video course on the how to do stuff. You know, for example, flower flower arrangements or uh, sort of uh, making uh, oil paintings or doing doing whatever. There are so definitely come on here and have a look because you'll be amazed at how many different quirky, fun uh, categories they have in terms of. Um, uh, the courses you can create and once again you don't have to be a qualified expert you don't have to have a university degree to do this uh, like for for example me right I can easily create a course here on Skillshare called how to create a blog or how to create a WordPress website because I can do that right okay? so and I'm, I'm by no means a, a guru or some kind of uh, expert in that field but I do know how to do it okay and the same goes for the next one which is uh, Udemy. Udemy is the same thing. It's just a, a, a database of courses where you can create courses for drawing, for you know, programming, for basically for everything and anything you think of. Uh, they have courses here, and you create a, you create a course, p uh, pl upload the course to Udemy, and then when people buy it, you get uh, a, a share of of the the revenue, right? And the same um, goes for Teachable. So you have uh, Skillshare, Udemy, and Teachable. They're they're all basically the same kind of thing, where you can uh, uh, create your own on online course, uh, where you can start selling your knowledge and selling your courses. And the last one I have for you here is uh, User Testing. This is a website where uh, you basically get paid. Um, to test a website. Uh, so uh, obviously, because uh, big companies, uh, when they roll out a new um, a new layout or a new feature or a new uh, design or whatever, they need people to test them. They need people to come on there to test them uh, so that it won't affect their business. And this is what you do here. And you can come on, log, on, log in, create a free account, and you get paid to test websites. Uh, now obviously, this is not something you can do every single day. It depends on certain criteria criteria you have to meet, uh, but it does work. It is honest and uh, it is quite a fun way to earn an extra twenty bucks here and there. So there you go, there, guys. Uh, I'll I'll quickly run through them again. You got Easy Shift, you have uh, Field Agent, you have Gigwalk, you have Fiverr, you have Upwork, you have Kindle Self Publishing, you have uh, Skillshare, you have Udemy, you have Teachable, and you have User test Testing. And these are these are platforms that will pay you a reasonable amount. Okay, um, uh, all this stuff about you know doing surveys and doing you know paid to click and all that nonsense and doing micro jobs and those things you know they're <laughs> they're not really worth your time. Okay, because the the pay you get is so low, it's just simply not worth your time. Uh, so for this for this particular video, I wanted to focus on things that actually can actually pay you a reasonable amount for your effort. Okay. Uh, so I hope that I hope you found that useful, and uh, if you have any questions, then just leave it in the comment section below. And if you can like and subscribe to my channel, I'd be very grateful. And uh, yeah, hopefully I'll see you again in my next video.